Where's that BB fan? Learn Bang. Back with another episode. We all love about that booty, yo. We love everybody, though. Bangin's out some more episodes. No drama. It's all about mama. No sticking to a strip. It's real life. Honey, stay tuned. And don't forget to watch them episodes. We all about that booty, yo. Thanks, BB fam. Love y'all. Day three, yes, day three of the seven days of seafood relaunched by the Mukbang Bulls and created by a walk in a fat woman's shoes, baby. So anyways, today we're having sushi. We got a couple of different sushi rolls. Uh, so let's start off right here. We got calamari salad in the front, and we got seaweed salad, and we got some extra wasabi. Yes, honey. Let me see. Take that down a minute. Let's see. Let's see if I can put this up a little bit. I don't know if you can see it any better. We got some soy sauce, wasabi, and ginger. I got. Ahi tuna sashimi with some furikake on it. Uh, these rolls are the spicy salmon rolls. Sushi rice, spicy salmon, avocado, cucumber, spicy pokey sauce, and spicy powder. Which is like that Japanese spicy powder. And this right here, next to the sashimi, this is called a tropical rainbow roll. It is sushi rice, avocado, tuna, Salmon, imitation crab, mango, mango coconut, cream sauce, and uh, wasabi tamago, which is the fish eggs. And then this is a spicy coconut shrimp with the jalapenos. It's got sushi rice, avocado, uh, coconut shrimp, spicy poke sauce, spicy mayo, cucumber, jalapeno, and sesame seeds. So that's what we got today. So anyways, how are y'all doing? Hopefully y'all having a beautiful day. And you said, what? Who are the mukbang bulls? Honey, it is Big Mac. You and me love shiny. Let's, that's double L for living life and positive serenity, baby. Yes, honey. And Sam's World. Sam's World, baby. Yes, where are my Sammy booze? <laughs> guilty, guilty. <laughs> love them. My extended family on YouTube. Love them, love them all. So anyways, uh, please go check them out and support them as well, honey. And uh, let's, let's get some food in. Oh, we got B on deck. Go ahead and say that. Mm. And some grape showed up. But let's get right into the sashimi. Mmm. With some wasabi. Mmm. Get a little bit of seafood salad. Mmm. Because that's hot and I'm hungry. But. The first two videos, I think I forgot to pray in them, so let's go ahead and give the man above that makes all this possible some glory, honey. So, Lord Jesus, thank you for this food. Thank you for everything you do in our life, Lord. I just pray for everybody in the whole wide world. You know their hearts, you know their needs, Lord. Put that extra, triple, dipple <clears throat> power of protection over them, honey. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Alrighty y'all. Sorry I forgot to pray. I guess I've been it's so hot that you can't think sometimes. 
But anywho, we're gonna enjoy the sushi. Look at this uh, calamari salad, man. I'm gonna learn how to make this because I know I can make a whole bunch cheaper than what I'm buying it for. Baby. At HEB, it is $4.49 for a little container. Mm hmm. It's just. It's a whole container, and this is a whole container. <laughs> and it's the same price. It's expensive. Hmm. But it's got that woodier mushroom, that sliced calamari, all kinds of seasonings and sesame oil and goodness. Come on, get you a bite. Get you a BB bite. Cheers up. Mm. It was really, really good. Mm mm mm. Mom didn't care for the seaweed salad this time, but it's not bad, it's pretty good. I don't know if it's real seaweed or like noodles, but it's pretty good. It looks like real seaweed if it ain't. <laughs> hmm. So how's y'all's Thursday going? So this is our second video today, since I got the other one up late. And this is the uh, spicy salmon roll. Mm. Yeah, so there's so much cheaper getting your own ahi tuna and slicing it. Man, I was looking at the prices over there. For a little bit of salmon and a little bit of tuna and some decoration and stuff. What like 15 bucks? I get two of these fillets. This is one whole fillet. At HEB in the freezer section for five bucks. So I'm like hells to the now. That's too much money. They're like price gouging. And granted, since I got a couple of things of this calamari salad, because mom loves it. And this, just the salads was 15 bucks. And then I got actually four different rolls. Mama ate the other one. We kind of shared it. But these rolls back here that I just ate, these salmon, and they have a raw salmon one that's not spicy. Those are $6.99. It's not bad. These here are like $10.99, and then I got a dollar off. Bro. They're really expensive. Hmm. And of course the shrimp one is a cooked sushi. Let's see. Alright. The spicy salmon and the is a cooked sushi and then of course, this is raw, and this is the sushi. The sushimi is raw as well. I'd rather have raw, but Mama loves her salmon. Let me tell you. Here we go. And I love my ahi tuna. So Mama doesn't care for ahi tuna that much. She did like this raw. Which I believe has salmon and I hate tuna. Yeah. Let's try this one. And the wasabi tamago is not hot because Mama loved it. A little ginger in. Mm. But anyways, hopefully you're all enjoying this seven days of seafood. Mm-hmm.
the bait. I know I am. I feel like I got more energy. So, instead of eating all that heavy red meat or chicken, there ain't nothing wrong with it, but it's good to take a break every once in a while. There you go. Cheers. Mm. Hope y'all are liking this new camera, let me know. The one I did yesterday, I did the camera facing me, which is like 1080p, which is lower quality. But I was trying to see the cam contrast on the green screen. And I know not to use, I mean, clear stuff like glass and stuff that mess up with the green screen. This frosted glass ain't too bad. Because if you notice, because I had a, like a plastic clear lid here on the seafood one. And like I look, and then I had a green thing up here, the game thing. So it looked black here, and then it looked like shimmery, and then. So I'm trying to not use too much glass or clear plastic. because it does mess with the green screen. And if you don't know much about green screens, uh, I watched a couple video. If you wonder why mine looked the way I do, I have my table backed up from the green screen. I would say it's about a good two and a half foot. And then centering your green screen. But I think the most important thing or just don't take two tacks and let your green screen hang in the wind. You have to have it smooth against the wall. You gotta tack it on one side, go to the other side, smooth it out. Tack, 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 and then where you need to re-smooth, untack, re-tack, all the way around. And then judge the distance that you can go from your table. I've uh, got the camera probably about three foot from me, so I can get the whole green screen all the way up. Of course, I'm gonna size it to the way I want on the uh, Olive Editing app, which is a free app that you can download. It is pretty, pretty good. Unless you have some money to buy now. But I don't, so I use what I get for free. But like I told several people, I got a Walmart 5000 lumen strip light right above me at an angle. It hits me down this way and it hits the back of the screen to illuminate it. And I got four LED lights that I got at the I have to link them in my description. Amazon. They're like 20 bucks a piece, so. But they're battery operated. You can recharge them through a, a cord. If you charge your phone, it's like a C cord. And girl. And then I got me a better stand. As well as a holder that holds the camera and the lights. All in one. And then you just connect to the stand, so. And then also when you're editing, if it looks fuzzy or off, you can adjust the, it has an upper tolerance and a lower tolerance that you can adjust to get it to where you want it. You just have to play with it. The color of the green screen, even though I got so much light and I made it, I use a different color than actually using the illuminated color because it worked out better. Just something I've worked with. Uh, yeah, and it's just about playing with it, but a couple things is be back from your green screen, have light illuminating your green screen, and illuminating you, have light pushing forward, 
And then I also adjust my lighting on my videos in my app or the olive that I got. I also adjust the um, the background picture I put. I also adjust it as well. So, but I'm making this video gonna look good, hopefully. Using the back cam, the back cam because it's a uh, the back cam does ultra ultra 4K. So. Anyways, you tell me how it looks. And in case you wanted to know, some tips on some green screen, I give you some of that. Because mm. it is hard trying to figure it out. Because I know I had some several videos that were like, <laughs> did I do that? <laughs> You know, I'm trying to get it to look right, you know what I mean? Anyways, y'all. Mm. This tuna is so, so good. Mm -mm -mm. Turn it around that way for y'all. Let's try this roll right here. With the salmon. I've got a piece of salmon and a piece of tuna on it. Mm. Yeah, I wasn't happy with that. Mm. HEB discontinued my uh that one roll I get, the Caribbean, we call it a Caribbean roll. It had like pineapple, mango, fruit, plus raw fish, and it was wrapped up in the, the rice paper wrap. Mm -hmm. They discontinued that one. I was like, what? <laughs> O-M-G. I put some of the sap or the soy sauce too. This one. But the good thing I like about HEB and a lot of places too. If you don't like raw fish, just look. Because it will say cooked or raw on it. If it says raw, that means it's raw. If it says cooked, yeah, yeah, you know. But I do prefer the raw myself. Mm -mm. Mm. And I've been enjoying watching everybody's videos. I'm going to see the video with his family, his aunt and uncle on his mom's side, a big old seafood spread. Sam's World did, uh, and I love that ASMR cooking, the cooking sounds, the searing and the bubbling, but she did like an Asian, a Southern Asian hot pot. <laughs> mm -hmm. Good. Everything looked delicious. She definitely has a plethora. It's falling apart. You love Shani, I think she did the, she did crab cakes, 
and like dirty rice, I believe. That's what it looked like. They look delicious as well. Mm. Big Mac did the rasta pasta with shrimp and uh, garlic bread and look divine honey so good I love me some Caribbean Jamaican food mm 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 There are going to be a few others I'm going to put up here as well. Let's put a video out on my drop downs. That way you can go check them out. Real straight off. But yeah, this calamari salad is so good. Mm. So flavorful. And yeah, it's just cooked, it's not raw. Mmm. Uh, mmm. Uh, Trying to make some room better. <laughs> anyway, me and mom having a beautiful day. Dogs are doing good. Fish are doing good. And hopefully you're liking the new pictures on the intro. That's, uh, I'll put their names, Myrtle and Houdini. Yeah. They're awesome. Awesome, awesome turtles. And then the big long fin, quite that you see in there, the real big one, that's uh, Mercy. Her name's Mercy. But yeah, I enjoy them so, so much. Man, I thought I was going to be able to crush this. Say one thing about sushi, it's thrilling. Plus the salad. And the beef. Mmm. Try this salad. These salads are so good. Especially if you got an H-E-B. I don't know what H-E-B does with this, but it makes it so good. It's very expensive. I know it's been 15... Probably about forty dollars worth of sushi. <laughs> Plus, I bought some more seafood, so I was like, mm. <laughs> but better. Come on, get your bite. Get your combo bite. Hmm.
anyway though hope you enjoyed Yes, it's still hot in Texas in the 90s. Anyways, peace, stay true, and you'll be <laughs> sushi bang, baby. So we're going to continue our seven days of seafood. So this is day three. And here's honey. We got a few more days to go. <laughs> but wait till we have something tomorrow. Good. You do you. Honey, I already know you want to be the best you. And never let anybody change you. Why? Yes, I heard it. Because you perfect. Yes, honey. You are perfect. Just the way you are. Alrighty, y'all. We're gonna catch you on another video. Let me sit and here and tell you stop all that. the hate on some shit us, that we need to get rid the of. human race. So I'm yes, gonna, say, let's bleed purple. So until then, my heart until gonna we get purple. one love. World peace. Without hate. Come on, let's Problem. make a change. I know it's not All too late, nigga, baby.